Tewananga Waltearua CEO Jim Mather's graduation with a Doctor of Philosophy was made extra special by AUT. It's possibly the first time a CEO of another tertiary provider was made the guest speaker at AUT's winter graduation ceremony. Ladies and gentlemen, would you welcome Jim Mather to speak to But the gesture was a demonstration of the commitment by leaders of both organisations to work together in the future, as well as AUT's wish to honour Te Tai Urungi, who had began his studies at AUT several years ago, while he was the CEO at Māori Television. A very proud day for the entire whānau. It's been the end of a long journey and uh, relieved that it's over, but more, most importantly, I'm looking forward to uh, the opportunities uh, that this opens up, not just for me personally, but uh, more importantly for the Wanan and um, how we can um, increase our reach and our influence within academic circles as well. Mather's PhD, titled A Critical Examination of Māori Development, a Ngāti Awa Perspective, was his way of making a contribution to his iwi. AUT Professor Ian Shirley says Mather's research will have great benefit for Ngāti Awa and other iwi. What I think is very significant about Jim's uh, research is that he went back and he examined the thinking and the writings of Maori scholars in the first instance. So in other words, he rooted his, his study, if you like, not just in the Western traditions of science, but also Maori knowledge, uh, and built an understanding of New Zealand's development over time from a Maori perspective. So he's able to provide a really critical analysis of Maori economic development and say some things that perhaps a number of people will be a bit uh, concerned about, uh, but I think opens up ways to really focus on the essence of Māori development. As we all know, uh, in our iwi leadership um, arena, there are a whole range of different interests and uh, agendas that come to the fore, but um, you know, really that's what it comes down to, what is in the best interests of our people, and then everything else must get put aside. It's a difficult challenge, but it's got to be one that is taken up. As a leader of the country's second largest tertiary provider, graduating with a PhD was important, as it set the bar high for other kaimahi to follow. I pai. Te kōrero, te kōrero, e pāna te mana o uh, te uh, huarahi mā tauranga hoa anō ko te tino, uh, mea tino nui ki te whakatinona te wā kōrero. So for me, it was also about um, setting an example and uh, saying that uh, we've got to um, uh, be able to represent the uh, results that we expect from our tauira. So, um, yeah, a proud day for me, but also, uh, as I said, a more importantly, a proud day for Te Wānau Wākero. His thesis will be made available freely online. Tianga Nathan, Te Wānau Wākero.